Oh, it's time, baby. <laughs> Hello. I just realized while I'm sitting here talking with everybody in chat, you fine people, mind you. Um, I bought beer today out at the brewery when I went uh, day drinking. It's sitting outside of the fucking mini fridge right now, just just chilling. Or lack of chilling. Excuse me. So I guess then, by a show of hands, should I drink... Um, the Mahalo, oh, hold on, hold on, super zoom, um, Mahalo, why is, focus, focus, you son of a bitch, with my face close to it, like that close, no, okay, fine, all right, so, this is a triple, uh, sorry, tropical milkshake IPA, it's Mahalo, it's delicious, I really enjoy it, um, or, Or maybe drink some water. I've been drinking water all day. Relax. Jesus Christ. Or better yet, you know what's better than water? Check this shit out. Are you ready for this shit? Thank you for your luxury. I love you, buddy. Um, this right here is a power sour grape white flavor. It is a kettle soured ale with electrolytes. This fucking shit right here is alcoholic Gatorade. You're welcome. Okay. Um, yes, I do have water here, so. You have to. It's okay. Got it. Shotgun a can of liquid death. I would 100% do that. But I think they call it hazing nowadays. Um, so. <laughs> I need to stop looking at Discord while I stream. Uh, Get it? All right, so I'm so happy I found this Sabat shirt. I've had this for a while, and I forgot I had it. Just, just look at this. Look at it. <laughs> Nothing is funnier than people that are in black metal bands that do not take it fucking seriously. So good. Um, so I'm going to go and get the Power Sour. I'm just going to get going here because... I want to see if I can beat this game in two hours. On or about two and a half. Corpse paid for time. <laughs> you're, you're either Dan Housen or not staying. <laughs> uh, cheers to all you fine people. Yeah, that's um. 
That's alcoholic Gatorade, 100%. I'm not an alcoholic, but I will drink alcohol. I'm a functioning alcoholic, if anything. Um, so, I'm very excited to continue forward in this game. I thought we did pretty good. Um, last night, we played, played like four hours. We, we unlocked all of the fucking doors that had the uh, special key. There's like four or five of them. There were a couple other puzzles. One of them, uh, Roy helped us out with. It was an Easter egg to get a um, three nails. Three, it's a nail shooter, but it shoots three nails at the same time versus just a click, click, click. So um, that was cool. Totally appreciated that. Can we start with the Vampire Survivors run? All right. If I can beat the game, I'll play vamp. I'll, I'll give it a Vampire Survivors run into GCW. How about that? But that just means we have to start, like, right now. Maybe. Anywho. Okay. I guess that is fine. It is fine. I need to beat this game. This game's fun. Um, so let's take a moment to remember what the hell we were doing. Alright, so we... I know I saved in the studio... I have nothing new for maps, nothing crazy there. Wait a minute, what was that? Oh, right. I already knew that. <laughs> um, so we've got the padlock, haven't really used it. Scab we've used it a few times. Stethoscope, we've used it. Combination key, we've used it. This is the other VHS. We Do we watch this one? Experiment room. Oh! Yeah, we did. We did. That's where we met the, uh, the little girl, which I'm pretty sure was us in the past when we fucking time-traveled. No idea what to do with the coin. Uh, Parchment Scroll gives us the hints to solve the monkey puzzle, but we're missing one of the cubes in the puzzle. God, I wish I was that game. Calm down. A hammer, which I have no idea what to use it on yet. I've, I've looked. And the mannequin arm, which we need to attach to the mannequin in that weird, like... Um, upside down world. So, I just, I had to end the stream early. It was very laggy. Probably my family just hop on Just Dance. Hey, you know what? Then go hop on with them, man. Like, Just Dance is goofy shit when it's with your family. Like, you know, like, who cares if your family laughs at you? Like, they've, Christ, your parents fucking changed your diapers, man. My parents changed mine. They've seen it all. <laughs> Bust a move. Oh, bust a move. Oh, now you got me going. All right, great. All right, so I'm oh, gonna laugh at you. It's Adam Sandler reference. Um, and then this thing with the lance charger. I found the lance charger, but it's I can't access it. It's behind a uh, gate. Carry. Oh, okay. Yeah. I think, but I think there is an Adam Sandler album called "They're All Gonna Laugh at You," and I, it's probably. In reference to that, but like a lighter swing of it. They nearly force you while alive. Oh, dude, that's that's gorgeous. You should do a family stream of Just Dance. I would 100% watch that. Good, wholesome fun. As long as you do the, uh, what's the one I did all the time? And it was so bad. Oh, Hey Boy, Hey Girl by the Chemical Brothers. Oh, my word. You tell me Carrie isn't a light movie? Yeah, it's, it's, you know, it's a nice, wholesome movie about life and getting older and, and finishing high school and being an absolute dick to somebody. <laughs> Rasputin was my go-to. Fair enough. All right, so I need to figure out where the fuck do I go next? I feel like where I stopped, it was very sudden. And I was like, okay, now what? I wonder if we turned on... Shit, I should have just done that. That was kind of dumb. Now I'm out here. Whatever. Um, I wonder if that hallway is lit up now. And if so, I can kill the dude on the wall. And get past him and get into those two rooms. I'm still looking for that fucking blank disc that we can write a keyword to to use to open the other door. That's to get to the basement. No. 
Oh, oh, it's through here. Right, right, right. Okay. Uh, this way. Oh, wait, is it still locked? Oh, yeah, no, it is, because it's from the... That's, like, the laundry room or whatever. I have to go through the other side. So it isn't lit yet. Yeah, that sucks. I really wish I could shoot that guy. Um, and get, move on with it. Movie about life and getting older. <laughs> yeah. Plus, bought just dance for the Switch. We never open it, and I deleted the game when they did. Wow, that's kind of a dick move. No, we just bought one for the Switch. Um, um, shit. Yeah, so I can't... I can't pull out the gun and shoot because I'd be in the dark, and you can't be in the dark in this game. So, now what? What do we got here? Oh, wow. I just had my phone blow up, and it's like a fucking list of links from um, an old neighbor of mine. He was talking to me to... Uh, beer festival recently and he was like oh I gotta tell you about these bands I found I know you're into some weird stuff I'm gonna send you some stuff and he sent me a bunch of links just now and it's like <laughs> it's like 10 different texts just blew up yes this is Super Resident Evil Super Silent Hill a little bit of the suffering if you remember that uh, that game yeah movement entering rooms the stationary a kind of stationary camera um Hell, the fucking maps, too. Green room, red room. Although this... It doesn't really work. Um, the same way that it did for Resident Evil. Like, if it went green, that means you cleared that area. There's nothing else to pick up or anyone to kill or anything like that. You don't remember the suffering? Oh. It was... Uh, it just... It's more so the bad guys in this game remind me a lot about the bad guys in uh, Suffering. And a little bit of Dead Space, too. Just having, like, the big swords for arms and shit. It's very... Um, very graphic. I do remember playing Fatal Frame, and that game was awful. Oh, don't talk to Tree. Tree played Fatal Frame 2, and that's the game that uh, stopped him from playing horror games. Uh, we did the pharmacy. This door you can't even get into. Um, because there's shit in the way. Um... Yeah, that door is locked from the other side. This requires the disc. There's a disc reader, and that'll get us all the way through and out. Sewing room's open, meeting room's there. That's how you get to the morgue. Library's all cleared. I finally get upstairs and cleared that all out. I went into the restroom. Dining room's clear. Oh, this is fucking clear. After watching Event Horizon, all I could think about is fucking dead space. Um, it's funny, before I started streaming, um... I bought my PC and I transferred Dead Space from my work laptop I was playing on <laughs> to my PC, like the save file, so I could keep playing it. And I almost beat the game and then like, I think I got, oh, you know what it was? It's because a bunch of people wanted to play Among Us because it just got big at that point. I started playing that and then streaming took over after that and I never went back. Um, but I'll, I will gladly probably restart that game and replay it from the beginning and go all the way through the three. But at this rate, they're rebooting the first one. Or like they're rema I don't know if it's a remaster or a reboot. If it's a remaster, I'll wait. If it's a reboot, maybe I'll just play it now. It does and then I'll play the reboot later. Um mm. these rooms were nuts. There's a ton of stuff in them. And that's also how we get to um, the, the priest is in there with this missing arm. Oh, God, I don't think there's anything else in any of these rooms that's even worthwhile except for this area. And the basement's clear. Yeah. I think I need to go back up into the uh, second floor west wing. <sighs> Sucks. Alright. The one thing that this game is missing that would be very Resident Evil... Um, I guess I guess Silent Hill 2 a bit um, is they're missing out on that, that Mr. X or that particular tyrant or whatever walk, like stalking around in the building uh, you don't have your Mr. X, you don't have your nemesis you don't have your pyramid head um, not that you need it it's just an observation I had 
Um, now this is the fourth stream we're doing of it. Her jacket bouncing is so satisfying. Oh, oh. I've changed the outfit. Um, I'm almost positive that... Yeah, I, I got a different outfit and switched it because it was this one. Wait, I don't want to combine it. Look at this. Yeah. So I switched it um, to this <laughs> to this one because <laughs> I mean you know it's probably cold outside. So I just kind of switched it up. Looks a bit more rugged and she's ready for adventure. <laughs> Not like she's going to fucking prom. Oh hey demon, <laughs> welcome back. I didn't. I forgot you said you uh, you took off for a second. Um, Okay, so from here... Oh, there's a dead guy. Yeah, see, check this dude out. He's got no legs. He's like Lieutenant Dan. And he's got like, these big old scissor arms. And he was like... Like Edward Scissorhands, like walking around with those. It's fucking nuts. And then this door is open now. I know that because this was it when it looped back around. Sucks when there's no fucking, like, lighting system anywhere. Like, I don't know how to turn the lights on for this place. There's no light switch. There's no... Oh, yeah, here's the monkey puzzle, actually. So I need to find another, uh, like, cube here to put in here for the... Or the... I guess it's a hexagon. But it's, you know, speak no evil. I can't change them until I put the other one on. I get it. Oh, do I just do this? Oh my god, is it going to pop up or something? I'd be so mad. No, I don't want to take it. I thought it was going to open it. Alright, whatever. I'll leave it there so I don't lose it. You have to see. I see if I'm my control and heads at the plane just dance. <laughs> There's no button for that miss one, though. Yeah, that is also true. Let me just read it one more time. This is very... Hmm. It looks like it... It looks like a judge's block. It doesn't necessarily... Yeah, it doesn't necessarily say that it's missing. So, okay, fine. Let's open it. And read it. The Monkey Thief. So there should be... Yeah, because it's, it's two, three, four, five, six. There should be five. One, two, three, four. No, there's supposed to be a fifth one here. Yeah, I wonder why there is no... Uh... Oh, you know what I bet it is? I bet you have to solve this first. No, because it's still not... It doesn't let me do anything. I don't know. I'll hold on to everything for now. I need a gavel. <laughs> oh, wait. What did I check on the... Did I check on the table? Just double... I, cause I, I swear I went through all of this. And there was nothing. Nothing unusual. It wasn't a joke. It's a judge's block. No, I, I know. Unless they, unless, oh, unless the hammer will work in place of that. Thank you, heavy. Jogged my brain there. What's going on? Can you catch me up? Um, we're just trying to we're trying to figure out a puzzle to solve anywhere and I couldn't find one and I just realized now I'm at one that makes sense. The problem is Do I have to put it in here for these to turn? Oh it does. Okay. That makes sense. So we'll go one at a time here. Right down run on down through it. 
No, I don't want to use it. I want to examine. Open. So the first one, the judge read the sentence aloud in an unwavering voice, his fingertips sliding rapidly over the small bumps that covered the surface of his paper. Okay, so that's either... No, it has to be see no evil. He can't read. He's blind. He has to um, read. He has to read through Braille, which is touch. So that's see no evil, I would say. So we have to grab this, put it here. We want see no evil. There we go. All right, that was two. Number three. The defense attorney seemed hypnotized by the angry movements of the judge's lips. Hmm. I guess I would have to say that's, uh... Speak no evil. Sinner Sisters, thank you for the host! Welcome in, how, how are you doing? We're trying to beat, uh... We're trying to beat, um... Tormented Souls today. Alright, so Speak No Evil's already there. Okay. Uh, this game's good. It's a lot of puzzles. Very similar to Resident Evil. Resident Evil 2. Silent Hill. Um, and then the bad guys kind of remind me of enemies that are was cross between like dead space and the suffering all right so that was that one so the third one wait oh no it's not the third one it's the third page page four is the third one because the first one's just a title the accused mother wrote in capital letters frantically on a slip of paper that she lifted over her head in desperation um over her head in desperation. Wrote down. What the fuck? Alright, maybe it was the one like that, because like the hands are up, maybe? Third one is speak, second is here. Because he's been mesmerized, hypnotized. I didn't realize it was a system of a town double disc set. Da -da -sh. Where is it? God damn it! So you think the third one is speak? I guess because she writes it down. Second is here because he was being hip. He was being mesmerized, hypnotized. Um, uh, actually, yeah, I think you're. Yeah, I think you're right on that one. Yeah. Second is definitely. <laughs> Soma, what's up? So we've got see no evil, hear no evil. And she writes it down so it's speak no evil. Okay, that's fair. Why do you thanks for whoever gave me the sub also? Oh, I don't even remember, to be honest. <laughs> but whoever did, they're great. Um, I'm going to guess it's either Candy Marsh or Tree Beard or Bag of Rye. No, not a fresh haircut at all. No. <laughs> in, in fact, I was quite sweaty earlier. <laughs> but thank you. Alright, let's get this last one. The gavel hit, its victim resigned. Okay. And, and so the cold blade inevitably fell onto the innocent's neck. Ah, okay. So this... Put it back in. This is going to be the headless one. Ah, fuck! I went past it. One more. And gavel. Yes! Oh, fuck yeah! A staple gun? A crummy commercial? 
Son of a bitch. A used staple gun. The power is adjustable. I don't know what that just did. All of that for a goddamn staple gun. Well, thank you for telling me that my hair looks fancy today. I appreciate you. I'm the puzzle boy. It's true. Carnival ass prize. <laughs> what part of Carnival you go to? Ah. Uh, oh yeah, Diz is a great resource to go to for that stuff. Good luck. Thumbnail on Discord is perfect. Oh boy, I'll have to see that. We have carnivals in the mall parking lots. Jesus. Most of the southern half of Illinois, we aren't quite that different. <laughs> okay. Um, why is this... Okay, thank you. You being, you being dumb thing. Alright, so why can I still... Nothing else to do here. All right, cool. I was like, why do I still have that button? Ah, there she is. So, I just got a staple gun. And I don't even know where the fuck I'm supposed to use it. Check all these rooms, I guess. It's like, oh, suddenly I found where I needed a staple. Oh, I can staple the mannequin arm. Quick, to the meeting room. Fuck yeah. South Park Mall fair fucking rules, by the way. <laughs> Is that the one next to the Casa Bonita? <laughs> Soup! What's up? Welcome in. Sketchy ass hotels. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's where people go to get killed. 100%. Oh yeah, they left to go on an airplane. <laughs> yep. Mm hmm Okay, so now I want to go this way. Hey, buddy. We need to go to the meeting room, which is across the way. I hate that I'm remembering where shit is now in this game. Like, this is a pretty big, blocky-ass map. Plus, now that I've actually opened up doors and gates that are, like, only openable on one side, it makes life a lot fucking easier. For instance, here we are, meeting room, done. It's living so many pizzas to those hotels, so many unfortunately naked bodies. <laughs> Yo, what's up? Jeez, they're not. <laughs> How you been, buddy? I hope everything is uh, going well at that uh, at the job of yours, man. I know for a bit you were telling me it was a little. Mm, hope it got better. It was fun. They all get like Call of Duty. Broke the shit. <laughs> for, for giving a carny a cigarette. My word. Kasoma. <laughs> I miss you too, buddy. You like I'm so hot in chat. Please stop. Yeah, the music changes in the game quite often, depending on where you are. Okay, so now we're back in here. And... Oh, I have the wrong tape. I just switched the tapes out. I forgot. I'm like, this isn't where I wanted to be. So these tapes definitely bring us back in time, by the way. So this is the chapel, November 5th, 1994. And now we're going to put in the tape... That uh, I didn't, did, I forgot to read. Experiment room, November fifteenth, nineteen eighty. I think this is where I want to go. No, actually, it's not. I don't want to be here at all. God, why am I so dumb? I was where I wanted to be. There's something I had to do. Oh, thank you so much for the lurk. I appreciate you. Thank you for coming in and um. And giving thanks for the, the gifted sub. That was really cool of you. I appreciate it. Yeah, definitely good luck with the PC building. Fortunately, you got you got Diz. And Diz is very good at what he does. If it wasn't for, for distorted views, um, 
I don't know how well this stream would be looking today because for a while I thought that I was I needed a new GPU and I was fucked. And it turned out that there was some fucking stupid default setting in OBS I had no idea about and I yeah, everywhere I feel the night, bitch. Oh, thank you for the biddies. You have to do that. That was boss music from Dark Souls. Ha. <laughs> Alright, so there is... Okay, so I'll show you where the priest is, which this... So again, for those who haven't been watching any of this gameplay, this priest... So imagine this camera, okay? Pretend like you don't know the priest is here. I'm walking over here. la di da di da di da I'm like, okay, can I get into the here? No? Alright, I'll go check the door later. Let me go check over here really quick, but... Uh, whoa! Right there. Every, every fucking time I come into a room and he's in somewhere... It, it, it's just like that. He's off camera and you pan over to him. And it scares the shit of me every fucking time. I hate OBS and stream elements. They give me nightmares. OBS is definitely a lot better. Um, stream, uh, I did stream labs for a while. Like the stream labs OBS. And it was not great. Like it was great for like the basic times I was in for it. Uh, that's locked. I forgot. But uh, it's, it didn't hold up well. Once I wanted to start making changes and making this, you know, making the stream kind of stand out, it, like, it couldn't do it. So if I do use, let's go. <laughs> Fantastic. Fantastic. This isn't bad once you explore it. The Stream Elements website is a bit rough at first, for sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't even use Stream Elements. I've been using Nightbot because it's super simplistic. And it does it does enough for what I want it to do. I mean, maybe I'll go to move to Stream Elements at some point. I was tinkering with it, but then I got Touch Portal. And I can do anything from chat that I really want to. Alright, he should have his arm back. Yeah, look at that! You're welcome, dickhead. Father, are you okay? Carolyn, my child, that thing has stolen my Bible. Stay there, Father. Right now, it's vital that you keep calm. Yes, you're right. I don't know how I'll be able to thank you for taking care of my arm, my child. Um, you, it's going to be infected and you're probably going to get gangrene and die, but you're welcome. IBS, however, oh yeah, no... I figured out chat box and alerts on stream elements, but haven't tried anything more complex. <laughs> yeah. I have a few of my overlays set up through stream elements, plus you can set up super mods that can mess with your overlays while you are live. Shout out to Pisky for editing my stream. Fair enough. Still manageable once explored. Oh god. What are you talking about, father? It wasn't me. But I saw you. Oh, uh, you are right. I'm getting confused. Now that I think about it, it was Dr. William who treated my arm. He remembers seeing it. We went into the past, and we ran into him. He had no idea who the fuck we were. And now that we've come back and done a few things and then fixed his arm, he's like, oh yeah, I talked to you about this. And I'm like, no, we didn't. <laughs> Jesus. We changed a ripple in time. That's not good. <laughs> Have a good night, Sam. <laughs> Appreciate you. <laughs> Dr. William, the Wildberger twin's father. Is he in the mansion? I had no idea Dr. William had daughters. Where can I find him? He's usually in his office. You'll oh. probably find him there. Can't get in that way. I'll go find him. He might be able to give me some answers. I need that disc first with the keyword. Wait, take this. I'm sure it'll be more useful to you than me. Is this a disc? Thank you, Father. I'm sure this will be of help. God be God with you, you child. child. Oh, you fucking yes. Oh, my sweet fucking Jesus. I never have to use the lighter again. I'm going to have my weapon out at all times. Oh, 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 ooh, ooh, this game just got a lot spicier. Oh, this is good. Yeah, the Nightbot timers is nice. 
Honestly, I dream about it. <laughs> I feel that. Okay, so now I need to go... Um... Let's think. What is the, what's the best way I can go right now? Stop! I want to go... I think it was West Floor 2. Where's that hallway? No, it's the first. Okay, cool. We just have to go downstairs. Good or bad? Oh, never mind. Definitely good. Because <laughs> the problem is in this game. Uh, well, it's not a problem. It's it's part of the story. Is. Oh what the fuck? Oh my sweet Jesus! I wasn't ready for a fight in the main hall! Yeah, GCW is into it. Can you not go through this? This man's moonwalking. another one around here somewhere oh god you understand I've come through the main hall at least 45 bajillion times in this game and there's never anything here like you don't randomly come across new enemies in this game unless it's a place you haven't been to before oh, I wasn't ready for that one fucking bit as as you could just tell wait for him. He's coming. He's like right... There we go. There's another one somewhere. Thank you for the clips, everybody. Hey, dickhead. Come on! Get up! Bitch ass motherfucker. Selling that like the rock sells stunners. I. Fuck you, okay, Mr. I quit Summer of 58 after one day. You shot his ass. I, if he had an ass. Yo, shoes, what's up, dude? Welcome in. My word. Everyone's here today. Um, okay, I need to get my composure again because that scared the ever-living shit out of me. Okay, right, we were going the right way. Got it, got it, got it. Um, I thought you jumping, the dude's flipping when you shoot them, huh? I love you, honey. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I just thought I just thought you were coming at me just to just to cause a problem. <laughs> uh, I'm doing good, man. Um, I hope your day is going a little bit better. Um... Okay, I didn't know how far down the hallway he was going to be. Jesus. You aren't wheel or wrecked on jump scares. Oh, God. Uh, no, Summer 58 did get him a few times. Like, legit. Alright, so... Fuck, I am... Not liking everything fucking reset here. Jesus Christ. Oh, you son of a bitch. Look who it is. Right, it's around the corner, I think. Hello? Oh, here he comes. I like that. There's, oh god, he rounded that corner quick. Yeah, it is like the rock selling a stunner. You're right. It's 100%. I was so good at Summer 58. <laughs> oh my god, god! Oh well, look who had another beer. Ha! <laughs> 
<laughs> Alright, I can go smoke this dude down here. Stop shopping. No, it's the uh, the white grape um, ecto cooler. The <laughs> the Gatorade. All right, anything can happen in here. Come on, man. I, I, the first time I'm in this room, and you're gonna pull that shit on me. Thank you for the bits, bastard. Uh, I've got both of my fridge plus Octofan. Oh, where the fuck did you get Octofan? You didn't tell me. Got him, coach. 15th September 1980. Anna and Emma may be identical twins, but their personalities are quite different. Anna is an extrovert, a noisy, attentive girl, while Emma is quite distant. Some days ago, and after much effort, I finished making two beautiful dresses for them. It took them a single afternoon to almost completely destroy them. They came back from the forest covered in dirt from head to toe, with twigs and leaves in their hair. The dresses were torn and frayed. For a brief moment, I almost flew into a fit of rage. Ooh, that is aggressive. Craft beer, Sella. Oh, I should have fucking gone there. We were right there. So I couldn't bad knew what you want first. Jesus. Oh, thank you for the rage dream points. If anything could happen here. Ah! But I pursed my lips and after taking a few deep breaths, explained through my tears just how much work those dresses took to make. And his eyes became misty and she babbled an apology, her eyes fixed on the floor. She seemed very regretful. On the other hand, Emma stared right at me with a clueless expression, and then for only a second, a mocking grimace appeared on her face. <laughs> her cold eyes froze my heart immediately, terrified by the expression and not knowing what else to do. I sent them to their rooms. They did not dine that night. Oh my lord. The good news is, there is no bad news. Yeah, I'd say so. Today's been a pretty sweet day. Good lord. Can people leave me alone? Why is it that every time I, when I try streaming, that's when people decide to start texting me and messaging me? <laughs> Bastards. Alright, so there is... Is that the door I came in from? No, it's not. Okay. So that might be the closet, if I recall. Hello? No, that's the shower room. Okay, so that is the other door I need. And this just goes down here, and then that's it. It's over here. Can I open this? Shut tight? What is that? It smells awful. <laughs> Okay. The button is stuck. Okay, can I use the fucking hammer on it? Bro. Really? That's pretty douchey. What am I supposed to do with this thing? Scalpel? No. Padlock won't work. Stethoscope, that's it. Fuck. And a staple gun definitely won't work. Good news, I'm not going broke any time. Fusion Strike looks like it's going win. Okay. 36 packs is only like 119 for the IRL stream, but only like 35 push-ups I have to do. Okay. Um, so, I need something to further access this. Maybe I have to pick that up somehow. Oh, that's nails. I'll take those. Yep. This way, anything? No. Alright, cool. Let's go check the storage. Oh my god! Jeff, yeah, fuck me! What the fuck? <laughs> Holy shit. Okay. What is this? Blood wash? Just launch something out of this. What is that? An empty box with a medallion shaped mold. Oh. 
that's one of the keys um, in the basement. But how am I going to make that? <laughs> what do I put in there? Definitely important for now, though. Nothing else to do here. Great. All right. Well, did everything we could do there. God, that was fucked up. You have a you have a new job or no job? Why is this one empty? Everything else seems pretty straightforward here. Hey, come enjoy your pea soup, kids. Okay. Such an awful way to die. I, uh, you know. Oh, it's... Oh, it's a disc! Sweet Jesus! Finally! No floppy disk. Names are written on the front. Oh, God. There's a puzzle within a puzzle within a puzzle within a puzzle within a puzzle. Shotgun shells. Nice. What's this? High pressure hydrotherapy device used in the early 20th century to treat mental illnesses. Oh, that's oh, gross. Not needed. Okay, so that's everything in the uh, the storage room. It looks like. I don't see anything. It's just a bunch of other more pea soup baths over here. Let's go. Doors unlocked. We're leaving. Whoo! It's that. Puzzle uzzle septa septuzzle. Oh my god. Alright, so now this I believe is on the first floor west side. Yes. So I'm in here. I need to come out, go through the studio, and then go down there. Alright, cool, 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 cool. I can do that. They were getting close. Real close to the end of this game. A lot closer than I thought. Hello? Oh shit. Oh! Another one down here, I saw it. You guys think you're so fucking tough, huh? Serial killer achievement unlocked. Kill 40 enemies. I've killed legit every enemy so far. I'm not missing a fucking person. <laughs> oh, Hello there. Soma, don't do that. <laughs> Jesus, it's going to be a heart attack. Oh, there's the door. Okay. Now we're in the warehouse. And in here... Is where the computer is use write a new keyword press enter to okay um jugger disc is right protected You know, at some point in time, a lot of other people probably play this game, and they would be like, how do I make this disc not right protected? You need myself to play that blow on it. No. No. Where is it? Right there. That's it. See the little lock right there? Now it's unlocked. It's not right protected anymore. That's how fucking old I am. <laughs> J U G G E R. Enter. No, those ain't got shit on this puzzle. Overwrite complete.
Okay. So now I can go to uh where I need to use that, which I believe is the west no. East second. That's west second. East second? East second. Okay. Got it. East second. Super doable. Honestly, beat puzzle. Best puzzle I've seen in the game. <laughs> you know, I guarantee there's going to be people either have or will play this game. And there'll be, you know, maybe like a later millennial or into like the Gen Z area. And they would have zero idea what to fucking do with that. Just because it's a technology that's just not, it's not as known anymore. I, it's definitely not as known anymore. I don't know anyone that still uses floppies. And I remember when the floppy disks were like fucking this big. Before they got like, you know, whoop, the smaller ones. <laughs> Rage quit. <laughs> Probably. Alright, so now we can run through here. Second floor corridor. This one always confused me on where to go, so give me a second. Uh, this is East 2. I just came out of the meeting room. I'm looking... Okay, so I had to go over here to the left, that way. And there'll be a dude over here somewhere. Oh, maybe not. Oh, no, there isn't. All right. Reading. All right, so I need to use... There's some type of code here. I need to use someone's name. So there's something in the files. I'll show you a floppy dick. <laughs> Disc. <laughs> there's got to be something here. I don't really want to do this ten fucking times. Or am I going to have to? What's that noise? Why? Why is every single time there's a day that's relatively nice here, the fucking rednecks live on like the other side of the pond launch off fucking fireworks? Fortunately, they're far enough away there's no like real percussive hit, because otherwise my dog would be going ape shit. Uh, no, this is Anna's. Shit. I don't remember Todd's newest Instagram video. Go. Oh, God. I don't know if I want to pull it up on stream. <laughs> Alright, that's the elevator one. We did that. This one is generator room. We did that. That's the uh, register. Uh, the lamp, that's the maternity ward. West wing, second floor, fusible. Oh, no, sorry, it's not that book. Okay. Maria's diary. Nothing there. Ooh. Nothing there. I'm trying to find. Um, Never accepted my follow request. He didn't? Oh, I'll fucking tell him. That f asshole. I like how you sent an Instagram to my father before you sent one to me. That's also a very funny point. I, I, you don't know what mine is, so I'm not blaming you. But thats I just think it's very funny. Oh, wait, I found it. <laughs> I remember they mentioned this girl had a lucky number. Oh, it's where the, um... It's in this book, I think, now that I think of it. It's someone... The pocket... 
The pocket watch stopped. That's what it was. Twelve thirty-five. That doesn't really help. All right. Well, does the disc have twelve fucking names on it? Nope. Nope. It doesn't. It has ten names on it, so that's not going to work. That is fucking horrifying. Oh god. I can only imagine it's one of those fucking uh, the face ones that put your face on different sh shit. I feel like that's probably it. I really don't want to do this ten, potentially ten fucking times. So I'm really taking, uh, really using, you know, using some effort here to to find this. I just... I don't think I've picked up anything that resembles this. Fifth birthday party. Why don't we start with five? We'll do number five. Basically. Oh, God. Um... So, I'm on East 2... Going all the way across fucking blows. I hate it. But it is what it is. Yeah, I was up one eight. I was up one night late, shooting the shit with heavy hand swings here, and I just was talking about. Uh, die Trump dies Instagram uh, or Jug Senior as he's known in here and the man posts some serious shit <laughs> thank you demon for the lurk I appreciate you buddy okay where the fuck am I going now why did I come through this way why am I so dumb the world may never know. Can I actually go around this way? I guess I could. It just seems... Yeah, well, now that I'm already here, fuck it. Dude, how many fucking fireworks are you going to launch off on fucking May 21st? What is this garbage? God, I hate people. They burned their fucking house down. <laughs> All right, Jesus, I'll calm down. <laughs> Thank you for the bits, buddy. I got four saves, so I'm gonna use one. Something tore off one of the priest's arms. Thankfully, the doctor, William, surgically replaced it with a new one. No, he didn't. I just did it with a mannequin. Duh. I didn't even realize a procedure like that was possible. I also discovered that William is the father of the twins in the photo. I should go to his office to see if he can give me some useful information. Yep. Uh, it sounds like they're on the, uh, the grand finale over there. Hope it's done soon. Fucking bastards. Alright, so I thought you could just make any keyword you want, but clearly it's one of those ten. And which one it is for sure, I really don't know. I'm going to start with the fifth, because they mentioned the girl's fifth birthday, like the, the twins' fifth birthday. So it's a big deal. So let's examine. Number five is Avatal. That's a weird name, but uh, I guess I'll have it all. Avatar, which is also Latvia. Ba oh, no, it's not Latvia. Damn it, it's Lativa. <laughs> oh, over I complete. I'll take the disc, 
And now we go back. If only there was a more direct route to get there, but this is all we get for now, I suppose. <clears throat> so, once we get that open, we'll be able to loop around. Oh, I know. Oh, yeah, okay. That's why I keep it that way. Sorry. Um, hopefully, we'll get uh, we'll get this going. I'll get into that door. There's a couple of rooms, and then we'll get to the office where this doctor is. And I feel like he's the he's gonna be a big turning point in this story. Not at the end game, at least, because we still haven't got the door um, downstairs unlocked. I feel like that's probably end game material. Come on, baby. Come on. Fine. I don't think I ever wrote anything. I aren't I supposed to like Hold this or something in place and then put it in. Who has two thumbs is getting Taco Bell for a second night in a row. Heavy hand swings. Nice to meet you. <laughs> Alright, I, I gotta apologize here, but I'm gonna cheat. Because this is, this is a bit much. <laughs> Floppy disk puzzle. And first thing is Tormented Souls. That's unbelievable. Alright. Da, da, da. Okay. First, make your way to the service area shower room. You'll find the floppy disk. Yep. Now that you have the floppy disk, it's time to reprogram it. Loot the service area and head to the warehouse. Once you enter the warehouse, approach the computer terminal on the desk in the corner. Disable the disk array protection before you can reprogram it. Yep. So go into your inventory and examine the disk. Rotate it so that you're viewing this out. Yeah, yeah, I did all that. With that done, you've disabled the right protection. Now insert the disk to the computer and enter the keyword Martha. Wait. Oh, Martha's not even on there, but that makes sense. It would, of course, be fucking Martha. Because that's that's the wife's name. God. Don't forget to remove the floppy disk from the computer. Now that the floppy disk has been reprogrammed, you can use it to gain access to the bedroom. God damn it. That is... I would have done all ten of those. I would have done all ten of those. And I would have been so fucking mad. <laughs> Seriously, would have been so fucking mad. But of course, it's, it's Martha, the fucking, the, 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 the mother, the wife. Yeah, I, honestly, I wish I, I had, um, I had leftover pasta primavera, which wasn't too bad, but, man, Taco Bell would hit the fucking spot right now. Oh, by the way, Heavy, um... I did play some Vampire Survivors earlier. I played all the uh, the challenge and bonus maps. Jesus fucking Christ. I got you a chalupa box. Oh, what a fr- You know, it was really nice seeing you today too. I need to go and ruin it. You're gonna be a jerk. <laughs> some point, will you carry me through some fast mode and make it look fun? Uh, Fry is the best fucking um, Phasmo player that I've ever seen. Um, I will, I will say fine. Uh, Insign probably because he plays it like it's a religion. never refuse to play it. Why are you yelling at me? Alright, we've reprogrammed to be Martha. Now we come out of the chapel area. Go back to the main hall. Oh my god, if this doesn't work. 
Oof. Yeah, it's taught me a lot. Oh, yeah, for sure. <laughs> yeah, there he is. <laughs> yeah, he taught me a lot about uh, Scrutinize when I started. When I started streaming, that was the game I was playing for quite a bit. And then I was like, I'll play something else. And then I played Narcosis, and I was like, my god. Anytime. I'm gonna go place uh, some soon with another person. You're always welcome to join anytime. Who are you playing with, Fry? Just out of curiosity. Don't be a dick. Thank you. Let's go. No, actually. Oh, nice. Ah! I thought this was a safe room. Motherfucker. Why can't I reload? Oh my god. I only have the three left in here and then the four that are in the one shotter. I love fucking all this group of people who have surrounded themselves with you all rule. Oh shh. No, you. My weapon does look like a hair dryer, but it's a nail gun. What vinyl is this? A worn vinyl record. T slud. Uh, what? Not helpful. Can't read it. It's probably fucking garbage. Throw it out. that oh cool I can save the game somewhere oh diary you bet 21st May 1968 I'm expecting William is hopeful but is more measured and demure than last time he hired a maid to serve me and she has not left my side at first I not like the idea but Anna and I have become good friends during these months together she's almost my age and shares a love for art on some afternoons, we talk for hours about famous artists, poetry, paintings, and sculptures. I feel a little guilty. I could never talk about such things with William. Of course, I never cared too much about the only subject he loves to discuss, medicine. Gross. Why did the music stop? I don't like why did the music stop. Oh, cool. More meds. Anything else around here? No. Okay. <clears throat> Time to play. All right. Well, hey, have fun and uh, um, definitely enjoy. Uh, tell Noxley I said what up, and um, yeah, fucking find those ghosts. Oh, here we go. Oh no, it's flapjack titties. Oh no, I've heard all about her. Oh no. Oh no. Oh my god! Oh. Oh shit! That's not good. Okay. We are out of shit. Out of shit. Equip. Damn it. Shit. Oh, Lord. Is this the evil dead? <laughs> That definitely looked like Evil Dead, huh? Alright, I need to... Take some drugs. And there's one nail left in there, so I might as well just use the fucking shotgun now. Or, or just don't select it, that's fine too. There we go. Not good. Not fucking good. Doors unlocked. Some sort of box, it's shut tight. 
can't do anything about it. I wonder if that's what... No, no, that's not it. Oh, that's not good. Loosens rusted parts free sticky mechanisms. Front of a metallic door. Have I been there before? I have. I know exactly where that is. Maybe that's what I need the uh, WD-40 for. Okay. 16 December 1994. I returned to the restroom where I left the subject and found she had escaped. How could I be so reckless? I have no more test subjects. And since everybody was relocated to the new hospital, acquiring new subjects is complicated. I will not wait any longer. I cannot stand by seeing her in that state because of me and my ego. I'll I will proceed to administer Maria with the antidote. Oh no. And you killed her, didn't you? The body's still warm. He was probably alive just hours ago. What is going on here? That's not good. <laughs> Shit. So there's really nothing else in this room. Oh wait, what's that? Bust an old man, one eye socket is empty. Well, I definitely do not have a green eye to put in there, sir. But once they find one, I'll know where to go. We're smoking drugs. <laughs> Fucking cheers. All right, so that wasn't super helpful. <laughs> oh, the children's room I still haven't gone into yet. So when I come out, head to the left. Okay. Probably Flapjack Titties isn't here to ruin my day. The door's hidden back there. Well, guitar player from England used to say that in his wanker accent. He's a degenerate for sure. Jesus. We're smoking drugs. This was her little room. More lore! 15th of September, 1980, we fled the mansion. Make as little noise as possible. We went to the port down the hill. Mother was agitated. She was having trouble breathing, and huge blisters were appearing on her skin. We were halfway over the old wooden bridge, 65 feet above the river, when men wearing those awful suits appeared from behind trees on each side. Oh, God. Mother held my sister and me between her arms as we inched closer to the railings. The men approached us slowly as the bridge started to moan and creak. Mother pushed us closer and closer to the barrier. One of the planks broke, and my sister screamed and fell over. I caught her by the arm, but wasn't strong enough to hold her for too long. She fell. I couldn't do anything to stop it. Mother didn't have any time to react and lost her footing, too. The men grabbed us and took us to Grandfather Noah. Mother looked worse with each passing second. Grandfather had me thrown inside a locked cell. He told me that no one could, would hear me, no matter how much I screamed. He also said that since my sister had died, it was of no use because he needed both of us to open the vault's entrance. Oh, so maybe I'm the sister then, and I survived. After he walked away, I was left alone, locked inside a cell with a single candle to provide light. I screamed and cried until I was exhausted. These may be the last words I will write. I'm sure I will be. I will sure I'll die here. Why did all this happen? I wish you were here, Father. Um, but she didn't die because we let her go. So that's the good news. What's that? Something could fit in this slot. <gasps> Oh, come on, you fucking douchebag. Nothing fits anywhere, does it? God. That sounds like Fishboat's sister. That's how she got bit by the copperhead. <laughs> the children's drawings are unsettling. 
Oh, Lord. Alright, so I have all these parts. I don't know where to bring them. Like, where's their vinyl player? It's like I keep finding more parts to puzzles that I haven't found yet. And then every... Just... There's got to be other places on the map I can go that were too dark to go down before. Not this area at all. East first floor. That door is locked from that side. You can't get in through that way. Oh! By the WD-40 to go in that way. Nothing there. We're in this area. Oh, God. Oh, I don't have the right to go through the office again. Um, anything dark over here? No. No. And none of this is too dark either. And none of that was too dark. Okay, cool. So it was just that one hallway. ammo or anything around here? What a gruesome experiment. I'd say so. Just go. I don't want to run into her. She's probably still here. There's no reason not to be. Okay. Oh! Oh! Okay. I can't undo anything here, so it's stuck like that. I don't know what that means. that was I wish you had to open that it's very interesting okay so um, I want to get to East Floor 1 I believe yep Are there really no stairs to get down there? Well, that's dumb. I really thought there was a way to get down there. I feel we're getting closer to endgame. Slowly but surely. So you get down to the first floor to the maternity ward and then take that secret entrance hit the upside down as we're calling it oh, fuck me I'm like why is there music oh, shit is she gonna keep doing that Fucking assholes. God damn it. Hopefully she doesn't keep switching rooms like that. Okay. 
Now we're at the door. One of these fucks is back. Try me, bitch. Alright, cool. Door. WD-40. Fucking Hank, Ho Hank Hill here. I can't use fucking WD-40 on this? That's garbage. Oh, that's so stupid. No, but I think you can use it somewhere else you were earlier that also had something that was stuck. I tried using it on, um... So the problem is, if I'm over, if I'm not in the menu, like now, um, if I try to use it, it just says examine and combine. I can't actually use it on that thing back in the doctor's office. The oldie rust trunk. I really wish I could fucking just jump over this thing and go through that door. It won't fucking let me. Did I meant the washing machine? No, that blew open on me and like shot that thing out at me. The uh the mold. I don't wanna be this way. Unless this door is magically open now, which I doubt. I didn't think so. I thought I had a switch that was stuck. Yeah, the switch was stuck. You are 100% correct. Um, but when I went to walk away, it fucking, like, blew open. Oh, fuck. I have to go back through flapjack titties now. Let's run. She's not in here again. Uh... This sucks. <laughs> it's East Floor One, I can't can't go through this door because it's locked and I can't go through this door because that's shut like it's like shut off um, it's it's blocked I have to go through here in the un like the the upside down but I can't open down on that door without something else everything else I've hit I just hit these two areas today. Just hit this area today. Did the upstairs last time in the library. All of this is good. And we got the doctor all fixed up. I don't think these other rooms had anything in there, but I can definitely double check. And the basement's definitely empty. All right, we'll do that. We'll go to the second floor west side, and I'll check the ICU and see what else is in there, just in, just in case. But I really don't think there's anything else I can do there. Huh. What's 
go all the way down the hall and hit the last one on the left. <laughs> Half a body is lying under the sheets. Oh, okay. You know, wasn't too fucking sure about that. Yeah, and there's the, uh, that's where the severed limbs are. Yeah, I don't know about all about that. Else in this room. Next is the bathroom. There's definitely nothing in here. I've checked every toilet and sink in here about a thousand fucking times. We did that. Checked those already. Nothing else I can really do here. Okay. I'll check the other side and go all the way through. I wonder if he's still here. He is. Where can I find Dr. William? You can- Thank you, Father. That wasn't helpful at all. Damn it. <clears throat> we'll go through here and run around. Is this door stuck? Lock from the side, okay. Oh no. Somebody's here. Or not? Anything else to do here? Okay. I forgot about this one. What's behind this door in room 2A? A big old bitch. Jesus, what is over here? What is all this garbage? Okay, before I go over there, let's check the rest of the room out. Someone near me? No. I don't hear anything. I mean, I hear plenty of music, but... I do not see a soul, or their lack of, lack thereof. Sit in that nice comfy chair. Uh, no. <laughs> Door unlocked. Oh, son of a bitch. All of that thinking I found something special. And I legit didn't find anything new. I was all fucking excited like there was something cool here. 
The chip was just a guy, I, a fucking character I shot shotgun shells at as if it mattered. Ugh, oh, god damn it. Just when you thought you found something good. Ah. Oh, I forgot those bodies are hanging there. Tough. Yeah, they both say the same things. What was that? Full of various medicines. Oh. And it's just like this skin fucking stretched, yeah. I'm playing it off as if like it's no big deal. It's it's pretty fucking gruesome. But I've just I've I've been through these rooms now a few times and like I don't know what else I can possibly get in any of these rooms. Like what other puzzles am I missing? heard something oh hello what are you doing in this room hello there oh soma i hear it it was just tinging This is where I just was. Shit. I don't think there's anything else I could do down here. No way I'm looking inside that. Alright, well. Nothing there. Unless there's something in those green, slimy, urinal-looking things. No. De most definitely not. Okay. This is kind of a bummer. I can't think of where to, um... Where to go with this. Sorry, just the wife checking in. She's away this weekend with some friends. So... I don't know where to go. I really don't. I mean, I guess I go down into the basement just to say, hey, we fucking covered it, but I'm not buying it. Mm, 
I am utterly confused. Oh my god! Am I out of fucking bullets with that now? Shit, I am. Oh my god, I have one fucking nail left. So yeah, so here's where I put the first key. This is definitely the second key right here. Oh god, is that supposed to be the disc again? Oh no, is that the coin? Doesn't fit. Oh, well, fuck with you then. So this thing here... Sorry, wrong thing. So when you open it, it makes that, that symbol. If you look there, it's the same symbol. Yeah, I have to get those three things to basically open this door. It's shut tight. And I, that means I can't use WD-40 here. There's no use button. I'm pretty sure this just controls the... Oh, that controls the lock. And then over here is a dead end. And the other way leads into the actual basement area, which will go there now. really want to know what to do here. It'd be fucking great. As if it was made obvious at this point. Oh, and that fucking... Alright, so that crucifix was right side up and I watched it get flipped upside down. It was uh, pretty freaky. There's really no point in going through here. Let's go through the morgue. Let's get to the other side of that. Shit. Because the uh, that area there was basically like a traversal spot. You had to go like up and around for it. That brings me back up to the meeting room. I'm gonna go back down here to the experiment room. What's up with the music? And then down here is like the holding cells. And I unlocked this where I got the key. It was right here. And this, I got something here. I don't remember what it was. There was something important there that I've used. Honestly, at a loss. I may need to uh, look it up, unfortunately. That plaque went with that puzzle, which I've done. Uh, 
<sighs> yeah, if I don't find anything in this basement, I'm probably going to just have to look it up. Because it's, it's getting a little tiring. And this leads us to the generator room, which is down here, and there, which there's nothing in there. I'll go to the dining room area instead, because it's a little bit faster. Not dining room, what is this? Where's this spot that I'm in? Oh, it's the other way into the generator room, that's right. It's not plugged in. Yeah, I know. any of that because it's on and I don't want to touch it because that was actually a puzzle in and of itself and then up here is the generator that can turn off and on as needed but I will leave it running all right we're gonna head back upstairs and then I'm going to need to search to figure out what to do next Unfortunately, I'm honestly out of ideas of where to go. All the parts that I have... Reef B. Don't like it. Oh, fuck! I just used my last fucking nail. I have to run past. Nope, I can't run past her. Oh god. Oh god. Run a different way. Oh god. I'm pretty sure she can't go through doors. Alright, we're gonna use some more heals. I have absolutely zero weapons left, except for the crowbar. Alright, how about now I just look for this fucking, like, uh, I, I hate to have to do this, but I just don't know, I have literally no idea where to go. Um, let's see how far I need to go here. Yeah, I'm, at, I'm up to staple gun spot now. Electrical lamp. Oh, I never picked up the electric lance. Oh my god, I'm so dumb. Oh shit. Oh, it's all the way on the other side. God damn it. Alright, well, I can't go through Miss fucking flapjack titties. 
so I have to go through the morgue and everything. But okay, I know where to go. So I need to go to the ICU once again. Which is that the first or second floor? Second floor. At least I can pick this fucking weapon up. That's a start. So, over here. What's up, bud? Back into ICU. Now, when I go through that bathroom, where the mirror is, whatever side it was on. Yeah. I'm going here. Boom. Gates open. Let's fucking go. Med kit. Cool. Love to see it. There it is. Homemade stabbing weapon capable of releasing electrical charge. That's sick. else in here It'd be kind of cool if we had some more shit like story shit I can't open it why Not that door. It, oh, it's probably that door, which I think there's like a hole over here. Okay. Because I can't backtrack it. Shit, so that's it for that. But hey, this is good. At least I have a weapon. Um, so now what? Huh. Oh, there's nails in there too? I didn't see fucking nails. Unless they were on the uh, other side of the wall here, and I picked them up beforehand. Okay. <clears throat> I did the washing machine part. Hold on. What is this blood bag they speak of? I missed something big. Yep. Open oh, cash was there. okay. This will give you morphine and coin return to the chapel. Use the coin in the vending machine. You have to play fi oh god, I didn't even what the fuck? That is bizarre. I have to get to the chapel, but I'm okay. Get to the chapel and we're gonna get married. But not really. Okay, fine. I'm figuring it out. Slowly but surely. 
Thank you all for uh, dealing with my ignorance here. But like some of these puzzles, that's the one thing I would say, is that some of these puzzles are not very... <sighs> Excuse me. They're not um, very obvious. Which is unfortunate, but uh, it is what it is. So I'll go out this way. We'll head back downstairs, go into the chapel and that vending machine. I can get a blood bag. What the blood bag's for, apparently, is to make that mold. Oh, wrong way. Which I do recall, there is a room somewhere that there's a fridge. I'll probably have to go back in time, put it in the fridge, then go present day, it'll be frozen, I can use it as that key. Uh, this way. bag nice so now I can combine the blood bag with the molds now I got blood in there and then okay hold up Okay, we have to watch the chapel tape. That's right. Okay. That's upstairs east side. So that will get back to the chapel old school days where the fridge still works. And I can freeze this shit and pick it up. And we'll have two out of the three things. First off, it's not the chapel tape. At the kitchen, probably? I think this is the kitchen. Yep. Oh, the fridge is over here. go now we go back through oh, camera jump back out yeah now we get to go back over we're getting there Like, if there's a way to kind of hint at, like, hey, you need to use the coin at the vending machine, I... Like, it said insert coin there, but, like, I checked that on, like, the first stream. I would fucking remember that. But it is what it is. I right, go to the fridge. A dying made from frozen blood. There we are. Now, back this way. And we're going to return to the main hall. Down to the basement. And I'm going to put this medallion in. I need to figure out what the hell is the third thing. Unless, of course, it's the floppy disk. And I'd be really mad because... 
It wouldn't really make sense because it's upstairs right now in the thing. Two. Okay. Uh, I did that. Very ba ba ba. Um. Uh, right. Sex first back. Ba 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 ba. Bedroom. Here you'll find a crawler, a vinyl, Maria's diary, and morphine. Go through the penthouse. In this room, you'll be introduced to the monster, a persistent enemy that will now chase you through many rooms. They cannot be killed, but can be knocked down for easier passage. You can also quite easily bait and attack and kite around them. So remember, I said there wasn't a, uh, a Mr. X or a Nemesis. So there is one. <laughs> uh, go back to the other door into the office. Grab the nails in the wheelchair. The WE40 on the stand. You'll also find one there. Uh, yeah. Returning ward from near the game. You go down to the ladder and through the mirror. Go upstairs to face walk and then use the WD forty on the rusted gears above and below the door. Then use the hammer. You so stupid. I was using it on that specifically. That's so weak. I mean so I didn't point it at the fucking gears, sue me. All right, so this is the second floor east, I believe. Um, turn no, it's first floor. It's uh, east. It's maternity ward. Okay, that's over here. Hopefully, shithead's not over here. But if she is, we got charges. Run. Jesus fucking Christ. I thought she was going to be the other way. Alright. Return a few port. This way. Down here. Through the mirror. And now up the ladder. This dude's already dead. Yep. Go here. Now you WE40. That's so fucking dumb. I'm so mad. Tilted. Now I use the hammer. To be yep. Open the door. Doesn't sound good. What the fuck? The skeleton of Siamese twins joins at the head. God, that's fucked. Oh no. Are we sure I don't have any more ammo? Well, I got health available, so let's just do it. That worked. So get back up though. Delivery room. Oh boy. Shotgun shells, let's go. God damn it. We got two shells and a fucking dream. I fucking missed? The hell I fucking missed. That is bullshit. Shit, 
I have no fucking reloads left on this. What the fuck is this shit? Oh, good, it's a mirror. Oh. It's a safe room, too. Just look around for anything else in here before I save it. Bloody ass fucking table. Oh lord. This is legit the delivery room. This is very centralizing. An old painting of an archangel brandishing a weapon. Okay. I just heard it. There's definitely one here. Oh, let's read this first. Love. Collect all of Mary's diary entries. Oh. 15th of September, 1980. William, they have taken the girls. Father put a sedative in my drink, but luckily I realized before swallowing it. I tricked him into believing that I was sleeping soundly. They got up and crossed the hall towards the meeting room, where I could see the light from under the door. I put my ear against the metal and could hear my father's voice intertwined with other men. Everything is ready for the ritual. The wild burger girls have been taken to the temple, said a voice I did not know. Perfect. If everything goes as planned, I will be the next leader of the Pollock sect, and together we will bring our savior back to the world, answered my father. After that, they walked in line towards the mausoleum. I must rescue my girls. If I do not come back with them, I hope you can forgive me. I know that you will do what is right. I love you. Oh, God. Yikes. So how many shots I got left in this fucking thing? One. That's enough to hit one and then run. Hello there. Hi. Oh, welcome back, demon. This thing again? That's help. Please be enough. It wasn't. Now there's another one. He's not dead. That's health. That's gonna help in a minute. Alright. We're roughing it. Baby, this motherfucker's spitting at me. Oh, I just died. Oops. Okay. I think I just fucking saved it. We just read that. I'm going to read it again. Yeah, I'm just bored and don't know what to do. Just go and watch the rest of your stream. Oh, well, I'm glad I'm here to at least keep the boring down a bit for you. All right, I'm going to go back here. Equip it now. I'm in caution. Okay. I gotta hustle. No, fuck you. God damn it. Okay, so I only get hit twice. That's stupid. I'm gonna have to heal up before I go in then. Pay F for respect. God. F in the chat. Okay. So let's go ahead and get a little bit of a restored health here. So I'm back to fine. Scooter gotcha. Now let's see her scooter. 
Why don't you be nice to your siblings? Alright, it's just... Yeah, there's nothing there. Right, right, right. Okay. Fuck. Okay. Bring it, fuckhead. No! 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 Fucking die! Oh, it's up, Roy. Yeah, I did. I'm all out of fucking ammo, though, which is a problem. Uh, we, we found flapjack titties. I didn't realize that she followed us around into different rooms. She scared the fuck out of me earlier. Now, this picture again. No, it's different. No, painting of an archie or British weapon. No. Oh, there's all different weapons. Alright, so that's a spear. This one was... Um, a sword? Flapjack. I've never used the crowbar to kill anything. Built different. <laughs> so this is a thinner sword, th as a thin sword, thicker sword, and, um... Fuck, what was the last thing again? Oh, it was like a spear or a javelin. Okay. Yeah, there it is. Alright, let's see what's down here. Oh, it's a fourth one. The day of our salvation finally came. Jesus Christ. Is this a fucking dead end or is this a door? Oh, it's a door. Door unlocked. Nope. Not dealing with flapjack titties right now. Okay. So what did that really get me here? I didn't pick up anything fucking new. Except for, um, the last diary of Maria's. What would you rate the game so far? Probably a solid B. Um, there's just, there's definitely points where they could use, it could use some direction. And the other thing that I don't, I don't really understand that bothers me is the maps. So there's the green rooms and red rooms, and I'm used to Resident Evil. And I know I'm not trying to say this is just a Resident Evil ripoff, but like, the fact that it's green and red, I would suspect that red means there's something still there. And green means you've cleared that area, but it doesn't work that way because I had gotten to when I got pieces of map, it had already been green, and I had found stuff in those rooms, and then red rooms have completely fucking cleared, and I can't do anything, so I, I don't know. But uh, I got two of the keys done. Um, there's one of the little bra the braille things you rotate underneath, put that in, and turn it, and then the blood bag. I guess I missed out on that. I actually looked it up. Um, but I get the blood bag, made the mold and everything, so the second key is in place. So now I'm just trying to figure out what is my next move. Because now that I've made it through this area, I'm not too sure where else I need to go. Because that was the big thing, which is in WE40 on that door. Are the green ones hallways or quarters versus regular rooms? Oh, maybe, you know, maybe that's it. Yeah, I think you're right. Yeah. Good fucking call. I'm just a fucking petty little bitch. Have you gotten any of the videotapes? Yes, I've got both. I've got two of them. I don't know if it's only two of them, but um, I have the one that's on me right now is the experiment room one, and then we just we use the chapel one to put the um, the blood in the mold into the fridge uh, in the kitchen. So I I feel like this is a puzzle for something though. These uh 
these four things here. But I don't know what it's in reference to. Unfortunately. Yep, got through the battery, went upstairs into the library, cleared that all out. It's the safe room. I can't go into that door because it's blocked off on both sides. And that just brings us back through, which I really don't need to do. Fuck, I may have to, though, because Flapjack Titties is around, uh, around the uh, other exit here. Unless, of course, she's now moved. There's only the puzzle and the clock in that room. In the library, or...? Fuck you. I will take the other way. Oh shit, I can't, I forgot. Fuck. Down the stairs by the dog statue? Ah! Frat! How's that Phasmo going? Dog statue. Just making some edits to stream and add the clip on to tweet. Oh nice. Well, hello, you too. I came in the minute you said, fuck you. Oh, Jesus. My apologies. Welcome in, Twilight. Welcome. See, now Flapjack Titties is gone. We're good. She keeps jumping rooms. Her Flapjackness. Alright, so I'm in the main room. Y'all could have you laughing. Oh, well, then good. Um, There has to... So there's a dog statue. Why well, I don't remember the dog statue. Dog Uh, I'm doing well. I'm just, I was hoping I was going to be able to beat this game before 11 Eastern, but I don't think it's going to happen. Oh, yeah. I haven't actually even clicked on this before. An unusual key design. I mean, yeah. I don't know. I'm gonna go and uh, I'm gonna switch back over to my other view that you definitely can't see that would totally be considered cheating. <laughs> oh, okay. I see. There is a clock in there, and I just didn't. I didn't know it was there. Um. Fuck. Oh, shit! <sighs> okay. And now she's gone. See, she moves around. Watch, now she'll be in this fucking hallway, though. Magic. All right, now this door is open. I'm gonna get back to the clock room here. Oh, well, not clock room, but apparently there's a clock here. Oh yeah, look right here. That never, that never even showed for me before. All right, so open this up and. I don't know what the fucking date is, but it's sitting right here in front of me. It's, it's Christmas something or other, so... Ooh. 
thought someone was just crawling on me there for a second. December 25th. And it was... Oh, right. Eight... Fifteen... Twenty-five. There's the Jade Eye. Okay. Now, where the hell was that? Oh, the office. Right, 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 right. Okay. I remember. I remember. Okay. Um... So the office couldn't go anywhere. Well, I know that there's a, um, there's a bust in the office. So I need to get upstairs. I can't do that from here. I have to go all the way back out and around. <laughs> Like, if I had more... If I had more ammo, I wouldn't mind shooting her and, like, getting around her like I had been doing. But, like, I ran out of ammo when all, like, the second wave of enemies fucking showed up around this place. I don't want her to use the eye. It's my eye now. Plus, I am missing that eye. Okay, the office is upstairs. Through the meeting room. big plots I missed while I was gone um, nothing plot wise really just trying to get some stuffs done uh, which way to the office from here I came out of here okay just come towards the camera gotcha okay there's the office and the office is this guy missing his eye. Put the jade eye in. Nice. What the fuck is this? Oh my god. The fucking vinyl player over here. I knew that was going to come into play at some point. I'm like, this doesn't make any sense. Worst puzzle. It's it's definitely difficult. Thirty-six packs and an elite trainer box, which comes with forty. Cool, nice.
All right, fuck it. I'm looking it up. Going clockwise, the solution is I was kind of close. I had the right steps involved, just not the right, uh, not to the right key or whatever. Why is she down here? No. Fuck you, you bitch. Why well, should be here every time? Oh, nice. Maybe not. Okay. So now that I have ammo... Notebook section here. Thanks to that stranger, I was able to get out of the cell. I hid the best I could inside the mansion. My grandfather and the suited men found me again. This time they took me to the sewers under the family crypt. Oh shit. He told me that I wouldn't be able to escape, no matter how much I cried and begged. Then he closed the door and left. Luckily, he didn't notice the lighter and flashlight I grabbed from the mansion. I found what appears to be a bedroom. There's a filthy bed, electricity, and even a functioning television. There are boxes of food and a pipe that provides drinking water from above. The smell was terrible. It reminded me of the suited man, man who struck my mother just before she freed us from the metal crosses. I think I remember the TV room. That sounds familiar. Seven years have passed since my last entry. The television that offers only local channels is the one thing that has kept me sane. Sometimes I wonder why I still hold on to life. Blisters have started to appear on my skin. I can feel a burning sensation. With each passing day, my appetite diminishes while the vomiting only gets worse. Something is taking over me, something evil. And I listen to the sounds of clanging metal from behind the door that leads to the underground temple. After all these years, I'm still unable to sleep with those noises ringing out. I mean, I, would, I wouldn't be able to either. That sounds fucking terrible. Door here. red lights. Oh, fuck! This is bad. This is very bad. Just like that, all that shit's gone. I was like, what are the lights? Oh, generators. What's that? Ah. Can't change anything about him. What's this way that you were blocking, sir? Nothing I can select there. Can't see, sir. Some sound hell shit. One hundo. 15th of March, 1927. I finally found my purpose in life. The truth came to me through this book and from the hands of the hand of the Creator. Right now I stand inside the sacred temple. In the presence of a God waiting to be reborn, I can clearly see my destiny. I will dedicate my life to the rebirth of the Pollock sect. Together we will bring back our Savior so he may return light to this wicked world. Oh boy. We done lost it. What's 
this? William Wildberger's employee ID card. Oh, that probably goes in the thing. That's probably key number three. Oh, that's fucking big. Now, is this door even going to open over here? I didn't even try it. Lock from the other side. Because of course it is. Alright, but this is good. This is good. Back up here. Back into the office. Back through here. And then through here. Yep. Oops. I'm caught up on the table because I went the wrong way. Go over here. Back in the main hall. Go all the way downstairs in an S formation. And then I put the ID card in there and that door will open. What will happen behind it? Don't know. Let's go. Yep. Obsession achievement unlocked. Unlock the door under the hall stairs. All right. Stairs. Is there a map? I think this is the, uh... Oh, God. This is the, um... This is gonna be it. The whole fucking kit and caboodle here. What's this? Decrepit bathroom? Oh, it's a save spawn. Great. Oh, we got some sparks to uh, charge that up again. We've got a save. It's a free save if you think about it then. I'll take it. Yeah, the beer. What am I doing? Oh, whoops. Progress saved. God damn it. Now, part of me wants to stop right there, but I need to go see how what, what is going to happen down here. If it's a boss battle here, I'm going to fucking die so fast. Because I legit have what? Oh, there's some nails right here. Quickly. those there whip dead what the fuck happened here that's interesting a bunch of stop signs let me check the other door then because that seems to be uh Interesting stop. Uh, I, so I have one heal left. And two zaps. Oh my word. Oh, fuck that. Nope. It's like catacombs. Oh, this is the crypt. This is what this is. It's the fucking crypt. Oh, good. The podium, so I must have preached from here. Oh, fuck me. Fuck. 
All right. So nothing else I can really do in this room. What's down here further? All right, this is a door. Jeez. I need a map for down here, my word. I thought this would be an easy setup for us. Oh boy. Oh, for fuck's sakes. Big marble tomb. There's a sculpture of a young woman holding cadouble flowers. The stench of corpses blends with the aroma of the flowers. Oh boy. This must be Martha's tomb. The carving of the golden plate reads The beautiful archangel suddenly lifted his finger. A golden shine from his ring almost blinded me, and suddenly the gates of hell were wide open only for me. Jesus. Oh! Shotgun shells. Hello! Get up, bitch. Okay. Get back to the one used to this thing. goes here. Something else I just don't have yet, I guess. Another puzzle. God, there's a lot to do here. I was really hoping for some more, uh, more, more stuff back here to help me out. Looks like it was all lore back here. Nothing actually helpful. That's very unfortunate. <laughs> I mean, that, getting the shotgun shells was good, but... There's clearly a puzzle here that I don't have a piece for. Can't grab anything else. What's this way? Nothing. Got it. Great. Alright, so I'm going to head back and I'm going to hit this door over here. Let's see where this goes. Yo, butt cheek, buddy. Hope you're a well. How is the souls of tormented going? Pretty good. I'm about to close up shop here in a second. What the fuck? All right, that's good. Got any more? Noah's diary. 7th November 1967. For years I cursed my destiny. I always thought my birthright had been stolen from me when my twin brother didn't survive labor. I hated my mother. I hated the doctors. I hated myself the most. We were supposed to tribute our sacred blood to the gods. The sect won't sacrifice a single child. They require twin brothers or our god will be unable to grow. Now I understand my role in our god's rebirth is not to give my blood but to lead the Pollux sect into his sacred destiny. <clears throat> Yikes. Not good. Uh, place to save coming up, I suppose. What is this? Yeah, it's the juggernaut, bitch! Oh, but she just wanted to show some love, homie. You amazing soul, you. Oh, stop it. You have to do that. Thank you so much. Super appreciate I'm you, my bad. friend. I'm a baddest motherfucker in the world. Magers with a sub? Three months going now? My word. It is That is 500 biddies right there. Um, I'm going to crack this beer. Uh, 
And I think that calls for some whiskey. In tree, thank you for the alarm. Um, I will be a couple minutes late. If you could just let me know in the chat what, uh, what the first match is. And I'll be there momentarily. I'm just going to wrap up shop here. To the most mighty butt cheek ever. Uh, Some sort of heart is placed on a cross. <laughs> Doesn't look like a painting. Is this a photograph? I don't see anything here. It's super helpful. We have to just go back and save it and then call it a night because I don't think I can solve these puzzles right now. <clears throat> this is interesting. We have two puzzles to do down here. So, looking forward to it. Finish this up. Much love and working on them cheeks. <laughs> yeah. Them cheeks, baby. So, yeah, this is a little confusing at this point. Because I don't think there's anything else I can really do. The good news is I've killed all the fucking enemies down here already. So that's going to be easy. At least I think I did. This door isn't open, does it? No. Cool. Fine. Whatevs. That's nothing. We head this way. Back through this door. Back at the stairs. Oh yeah, what was yeah, this? This is night, bitch. Oh, another hundred? My word. Oh yeah, this door. Alright, hold on. Let me just save the game first, because I feel like that is um that's gonna be a problem and I'm probably gonna die really quick. So let me just save the game, then when I die I'll, I'll we'll, we'll call it a day. Or a night, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> cool. And there we go again. <laughs> yeah, it's the sugar knock, bitch. Megas with 200 biddies, my goodness. You two are too good to me. I appreciate the hell out of both of you. Save it up. God, we're breaking 10 hours in this game? Woof. Progress saved. All right. I'm gonna go see what's behind this door, and once I die, that's it. <clears throat> we just want to send you off right. Oh. But yeah, I'm, I'm gonna be watching. Uh, so, so GCW Game Changer Wrestling is having a pay per view tonight. Um, Tree is in my Discord streaming it. I'll be there watching it. You should not have come in here. What the fuck? Base is filled with embers. Water. Earth. Basin is empty. Wooden door. Oh! Copper door. Golden door. And then the door I came in in is steel? Iron. Damn. Okay. Uh... I am preparing to start a new adventure. I wish only to find what every ambitious man looks for to escape poverty. Gold. I mean... You, you don't want water. You don't want... Earth. Embers. Copper. Woods. Iron. Um... Nothing. I, you gotta go gold, I assume. Or not. Oh, I fall into the sea and never learn to swim. I'm three feet under the water. My only wish is to have that which we've had for all our lives. For now, its absence will kill me. Um. Oh, it's changed. Water. This is the Leo Lu Dallas multi puzzle. Yeah. <laughs> 
Earth. So how do I open the door for Earth? Does that mean this this door? I guess it means this door. I'm preparing to start a new adventure. I wish only to find what every rich man looks for to escape poverty. That's gold, but everything's changed now. This is weird. Gold. Oh, look at the fire up top. So I'm, I'm three turned to the water. I wish to have that which we've had for all our lives. For now, its absence will kill me. And that's Earth. Like, do I choose the wooden door? Which is going to be this one over here. Nope, it reset. All right, I'm gonna call, I'm actually gonna call it there. It's um it's it's past that time. Um, I'm intrigued to see where this goes for sure. But um, yeah, we, we went over time of where I wanted to be. I would have loved to have gotten this game completely done, but you know, this is what it is. We just gotta play it a bit more, and then we can you know we'll be able to finish it up. Um, definitely before I leave for MDF. Uh, that will not be a problem at all. Um, so yeah, thank you for everyone for coming through, hanging out. We had a bit of an early stream today, uh, just because of GCW. If you feel like you want to come by and watch something with us, hop into Discord, hang out. Um, we won't bite. Uh, but uh, I gotta figure out where who we're gonna fucking raid here. Who are we raiding? And I don't mean fucking raiding as in like the Mortal Kombat guy. Let's see, who's on? I mean, besides me, obviously. Got lots of people on. Actually, you know what? How can we... How can we not... Raid Bag of Fry? I mean, come on, honestly. <sighs> much love. Have an amazing rest of your Saturday, bro. Yeah, hey, you too, man. Appreciate you so much. Uh, you and Megers alike. Um, yeah, let's go over. Let's hang out with. Ba oh, so it's technically Bag of Rye. I call her Fry. Uh, it's my good friend IRL, and um, she makes for an awesome mod. And I appreciate her, and I think she deserves the raid. Right back at you. Um, so she's playing Phasmo. It's her game. She she streams it pretty much exclusively and she's one of the best at it um, I don't know if Heavy is actually playing with her or not but she's definitely playing with Noxler uh, so yeah let's uh, let's go hang out and um, I will probably be back around tomorrow night trying to finish this goddamn game oh. alright good night Thank you.